What's going on guys? Welcome back to another War Thunder video. No gameplay today, unfortunately, but I do have some interesting stuff to talk about. Uh, I want to apologize for the lack of videos here in the last uh, four weeks, maybe three weeks. Uh, they've been very sporadic, and that's because I've been burned out on airplanes, to be honest with you. This happens every four or five months, I would say. I just get tired of them. And I've I've been uh, trying to get away from, from planes and playing tanks. And that's worked out really well because I'm starting to get back into planes. I've been flying the N1K and uh, the LA-7B20. i got a LA-7B20 video coming out very soon. I flew that that out with uh, R-Max, a terrific pilot. Well, I'll look for that video very soon. But in the meantime, I want to do a little tech tree progression video. Uh, I've been grinding the hell out of this game Mostly with 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 uh, tanks, not not so much with planes. But I, I do have some uh, plane grinding to show you. Um, and this is this is a great time to do some grinding. Excuse me, wrong wrong menu. Because of the Thunder League special booster, you get the 100% RP booster, which lasts for eight days. I'm gonna use use take advantage of this and grind the hell out of some stuff. We're gonna start off with the Japanese tech tree. And I should, I should mention that the reason I, I'm doing this video, by the way, is because I've been getting requests for planes that I just don't have. So that's that's why we're doing this. For Japan, I have everything unlocked as far as you know, each plane, but I don't have all, all the upgrades. For the normal fighters, I have everything spaded until the J7W1. Excuse me. Uh, jets, I've barely touched anything. The R2Y2 is probably the one I have the most, most progress with. And you can see that's only not even quite half upgraded. And the rest of them are, are even less so, like the Kika. Flew that out. Let's see. One time it says. And I, I think that's a lie. I think I flew it out a couple of times. Uh, I'm pretty sure you get 10 free repairs with, with these. But anyway. Uh, first video, or the, the fir very first flight. I got shot down by a subscriber. <laughs> he apologized for shooting me down. I thought that was hilarious. Uh, anyway, uh, attackers, I have everything spaded here except for well, I got this bomber here. And uh, the Q-102, I don't have that one. The, the regular bombers, I have until the G5N1. And G-N1, I don't have. Uh, G5, I have, I have more more upgrades than, than I expected. But this is because of some uh, bombing runs that I made with Brian probably six months ago. Had a lot, had a lot of fun doing that. Premiums, I don't have all of them. The Corsair is probably the one that I use the most. I got the A7M1 video on the way, so keep an eye on that. Uh, Focke-Wulf, got that a long time ago. A6M5 was part of a pack. Very good plane, over-tiered, but that's, that's Japan for you. Uh, Great Britain, um, lots of spades, some early stuff not done, like the Nimrod, I think I'm missing something here, Nimrod, and cover, but most of these are spaded, uh, the Firefly, the first one, had engine injection added to it, so I have to go back and, and respade that, but most of the British fighters are spaded, the heavy fighters, not so much, the later bow fighters, mosquitoes, bombers until the first Wellington, or, excuse me, the third Wellington. Or is that the fourth Wellington? There's two here. Yeah, fourth Wellington. The Mark 10. Everything else after that, I don't have. I don't have the the second Sterling unlocked yet. And got the Lancaster still to go, but that's again. The Mark 24, I don't have. That's because I just need the bomb pylons. Not a big deal. Now, as far as jets, I flew the jets a lot in arcade, uh, I want to say three months ago, in preparation for arcade tanks, or excuse me, for the uh, uh, British tanks. Uh, I flew the Vampire, got a bunch of unlocks for it, and got the Attacker spaded, the Sea Meteor spaded, mostly because of uh, Talisman that I bought. I got the Talisman because I wanted to eventually get the Hunter, and at the time, I knew the, the Venom was going to be placed in front of the Hunter and I needed to get the Venom, so I got the Venom unlocked and I only got the 20 mils unlocked so far. And this is the basically the state of most of my other 
uh, meteors. The other meteors are just like that. Cameras are... Yeah, that's about it. I don't... I'm not a jet bomber or a jet fighter in just in general. So, jets are are not a priority for me. As far as premiums, I got a handful of the early ones, including the DB7, which is a fairly rare vehicle. And we got the Hellcat and the Typhoon, of course. Now, the British tanks, I... I bought the Achilles, highly recommended it. Uh, video coming soon. I have unlocked everything until the last tank so far, and that's the Conqueror. I just unlocked the Centurion Mark 10 last night. Um, they nerfed the crap out of the APDS rounds, which is making me not want to play British tanks right now. The Centurion Mark 3, Mark 10, Carnarvon, or whatever, however you pronounce that, uh, they've been nerfed like crazy. I got the, I got some of these uh, spaded. Let's see, got this Churchills and Fireflies and a whole bunch of these still left to, to uh, spade. See the Archer. I've never even tried the Archer. It's a tank where you have to re play it in reverse. It's so bizarre. <laughs> uh, tortoise. I am loving the Tortoise. I'm, I'm glad you guys enjoyed that video on the Tortoise. It's, it's huge. It's slow. It's heavily armored, and it's fun. I got a lot of unlocks to go though. Um, that's about it for that. We'll go to the Soviets. I this is the line that I use the most. Uh, Soviet Union. I have I played the cr the crap out of the T-34s. I love the 76 millimeter guns on the T-34s. I did most of my most of my grinding in the in the Soviet tech tree with the T-34s. Believe it or not, this is one of the one of the tech. One of the uh, bundles that I recommend is the this uh, premium T34. If you can't get the T34E, which I don't have at the time, I, I use this. I think this is the most. I think I have the most kills of any tank is with this one. And you got the Panther. This just came out today, by the way. Just part of the Thunder League and Dog Tag system. You got the Panther. Just came out today. I'll be doing a video on that soon. As far as where I'm at, I'm all the way down to the IS-3. Um, I'm actually pretty far in the in the tech tree. I don't have very many spades though. You know, I say T-44s. I only got a handful of games in that. Still got that's less than half spaded. Uh, KVs, T-34s are mostly spaded. IS-1. Where am I in that? Very close. Got a couple, two two unlocks to get. Tank destroyers I've barely touched beyond tier th three actually. SU 85s I've barely touched, but I enjoyed the SC 152. Great big gun. Uh, PT 76 was a newer tank. Uh, hate it. <laughs> it's got no armor. I hate it. I'm I'm actually wondering if I'm gonna enjoy these later tanks, the 7.7s. I hear the. It's a, it's all T10Ms versus Leopards, and I don't know if I'm going to enjoy that. Well, we'll see. So the aircraft is... I've got a ton of stuff. Most people are going to be surprised by all the premiums that I have. Um, yeah, look at them all. <laughs> you can tell this is a, a, a Russian company, because there are so many Soviet vehicles, so many, so, Soviet premiums, I should say. But as far as spades... I'm. I have most of my of, of my Soviet fighters spaded. I think down to the Yak Nine UT, which I've I don't know half half done maybe. Yeah, about half done. It's all the gun unlocks right now. Uh, got the LA Nine, LA Seven's all done. The yeah, second I One Eight Five just needs some bomb pylons added. And as far as jets. I think my MiG-9 is the most upgraded of all the jets, and I've barely touched that in months. MiG-15 BIS, I yeah, see, I don't have the MiG-17 MiG yet. The BIS, I have some upgrades, because I bought a Talisman, and uh, I flew this a lot during a bomber hunting event, and I uh, got 100 kills, or, or more or less. And that's why my uh, stat card is how it is. It's not because I'm really good with the MiG-15, I'm, I'm not. It's just bomber hunting. Stat cards lie. And as far as attackers and bombers, it's it's really frustrating to, to do uh, to do these because they're all like the same plane. 
they're just duplicates for the most part. I realize that there are very, very similar dis, uh, differences, but for the most part, they're all the same plane, and it's really difficult to, or I should say, it's frustrating to get all these unlocked. And this is a, a theme I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with. You don't have very many of these spaded, and I can't blame you. Uh, Germany is much the same. Uh, a lot of SM79s. Look at them all. Oh my god. And some of these. I uh, half upgraded. Some of them are spaded. Uh, as far as fighters, I have most of my German fighters spaded. Let's see. I don't have the, the first 109. That's because it has terrible guns. I think I took that out two or three times. I'm telling you, two machine guns. I mean, that, that's, that's not a 109. <laughs> that's a wannabe 109. But the newer planes, that the Doe 17s, I don't have spaded. I have the first one here. But the Z2, I'm close. And I actually want a talisman on this stupid thing. Oh my god. What a waste of a talisman. Uh, bombers are, you know, again similar to the, to the uh, Russian, the Soviet Tech Tree. With the G2 to spade, I'm close. Wing repair, engine, in, engine injection. I can take this out a couple of matches and get that. Ducks. Let's see. Barely touched this one. I don't like the the B3. The B2 is actually kind of fun. Let's see. Yeah, I, I got the the premium one because it came as part of a pack. Actually, quite cheap. Uh, jets. I've barely touched any of these jets. The first ME262, I got. I almost got the first one luck. <laughs> uh, I was going to do a video on this. I think I must have deleted it. Like, I can't find it. I'm going to have to do a little more searching. It's actually had some good, some good footage from that. The K4 is the one, uh, is the one German aircraft that I want to get spaded more than anything. Because I know people are, are are really interested in seeing this uh, this and the Ta. The Ta is a piece of crap. I have flown against it. It is garbage. One day the Ta is going to have a good flight model. It may be six years from now, but it'll eventually show up. I have the D9 spaded and threw a talisman on that a long time ago. I used the D9 to grind almost everything in the German tech tree. The D12 is... I've almost got it. It's got the bomb pylons. Not a big deal. Got a lot of requests for the D13. I don't have it, guys. I'm sorry. I don't have it. And yeah, that's that's the Germans. And we'll go to over to the over to the tanks. And you see, I've I've gotten a lot of the German tanks up until tier four. Uh, tier four, I've I've hit a, kind of a roadblock. Tier four vehicles take a long time to research. Got the first Tiger II. I need to get this unlocked soon because there's a there's a Thunder League uh, skin like an unlock here, uh, and I need that to get to get. Yeah, you know, here we go. Got the Poltergeist team. I want to get that skin unlocked, but I have to unlock the tank itself first, and well, it's going to be a while. But I did get the VK4501. That's the Porsche Tiger. I'm liking that. That's going to help me through my grind. I'll be doing a video on this very soon. This was one of the, I believe it was a Christmas grind session. This and the, let's see, where was it? And the P63C5, That's that was all part of the same event. Just a matter of whether you chose planes or tanks. And I, I got them both. That's that's one of the reasons I'm burned out a little bit. I've, I've just been so focused on this, this grind thunder, as, as people like to refer to it. It just takes forever to, to unlock stuff. And I'm in the same boat as you. You guys are. I don't get, I don't get uh, special access to anything. If I want something, I have to either grind it or buy it. Just like you guys, I don't get any sort of special access because I'm a YouTuber. Um, as far as unlocks, or excuse me, as, as far as uh, spades, I don't have very many spades. Uh, the Tigers are my favorite tanks in Germany right now. The Panthers, I I would love the Panther if it had a better gun, but the 75 millimeter. It just does not compare to the 88 at all. And let's see, let's see, we covered. Oh, I get to show off the the new 109. This was uh, this came out today as part of the Thunder League, along with that uh, uh, Russian, excuse me, the Soviet Panther. 
This came out today. And uh, I haven't even flown it. I haven't flown it, so I, I don't want to have a video for at least a few days. It looks interesting. And anyway, on to USA. Uh, we're going to start with the airplanes. I have I don't have the XP-55. I know some people have been requesting that. Funny thing about the XP-55 is I had a one-hour... Uh, it went on our test flight of this thing that I won after a battle. And I, I flew it out five times, got five matches. I was going to do a video on it. And the next, or that very day that I was going to do the video, Gaijin releases a flight model update, completely changing the flight model from what I, I, I hear. So that footage is gone. <laughs> completely useless. So no XP-55 video. Uh, I don't plan to, on buying it. Um, it's it's just too expensive for me. I can't afford it right now. I bought so many other planes and tanks. I, I can't afford it, all this other stuff. You know, as far as premium, or excuse me, as far as uh, vehicles, I have everything unlocked. Uh, I don't have everything spaded, though. Let's see. I need the Helldiver spaded. The Bearcat, the Tiger Cat spaded. And all the jets. Jets and uh, attackers, again. Bombers are not my favorite, so everything from the B-17 on, there's barely any upgrades. I think the, B, let's see, B-17E, yeah, I have almost all of these, just a few missing, but uh, B-24, just a couple of unlocks. No, that's pretty pretty typical of the rest of my bomber lineup. Uh, B-57s, barely touched them, can't, can't be bothered with them. They're terrible planes. I, I hate bombers. <laughs> as far as jets, uh, the, the Banshee is the only thing that I have spaded, and that's because I bought the most of these actually with uh, gold when that first came out. Uh, jets, P80 is the most researched from actually grinding the, the modules. Uh, I said about a quarter of the research done. That's not very far. Panther, yeah, it's, this is typical. Not even a single unlock. Uh, sabers are the same way. Nothing. Haven't even flown the F2. F84. <laughs> I've got a long way to go. As you can see, just got the 50 kills up, up upgraded. F80C. Same, similar as the other jets. As far as tanks, I I barely touched the the the, the American tech tree. Once I got to the Shermans, I just gave up. The Shermans are so frustrating to, to use. They the armor it does nothing. The the seventy five millimeter guns on some of these like the, I really had high hopes on the Cobra King. But the the rewards are are not as as impressive as you would hope for. You need to get side shots on everything because the seventy five millimeter gun doesn't kill doesn't kill anything really at, at, from a frontal shot. You have to get you have to get somebody who's really unfortunately or who was very unfortunate and he got up tiered because uh at five point this is a pain in the ass to use the 76 millimeter guns i like but uh beyond that i'm i'm hoping to use the bulldog i threw a talisman on that and uh i've i've taken it on a few times but the the thing that's keeping me from using it more is the fact that the apds round was recently nerfed uh, un unfairly, by the way, it was nerfed incorrectly, I should say. So I'm, I'm waiting for them to fix that and get that. I'll be rolling that tank out and I'll be using that 100% uh, RP booster. That's part of the Thunder League and get these these research. I want to get I want to get some of these research because I I know Cracker from the Cube uh, team. He really likes the American tanks and there are some good tanks. I've seen him use them. Very good tanks, but unfortunately, once you get the start of tier four, it's Really frustrating. I wouldn't mind getting the, the M46 or the M26, but it's way too expensive right now. If I could do it again, I would probably buy the M26 or the M46 at Christmas when they're half off. I, I kind of regret not buying them because there are some very good tanks in here. Um, but I'm I'm real I'm waiting for the the Sable Run to be unnerfed and uh, be using that Bulldog quite a bit here in the next couple of days. Or weeks, depending on whenever Gaijin gets around to it. I also got the M24 Chaffee, which was part of the Thunder League. 
It's not a premium, unfortunately, and as such, you don't get everything unlocked automatically. So I have to grind these. I, I just started this last night. Um, just got the, I, the... The whole reason behind this this one and why it's good is because of the, the composite run. Other than that, it's, it's just a normal uh, chappy, just like the other, the other one that's in the tech tree. Same battle rating and everything. Same armor, I believe. Just got that, that composite run, but I'm looking forward to getting that and trying that out. Um, it's going to be a while to, until I get that unlocked, because that's, that's a lot of upgrades. Anyway, guys, I thank you all very much for watching. If you saw anything in this tech tree video that you wanted me to take out, uh, let me know in the comment section below. Um, I'm going to take out the P47M very soon. If you, I know some of you might really want to see that. I know I have a couple of requests for that. I'll, t I'll be taking that out soon. Maybe taking a bomber out like the like the Invader. I haven't taken that out in a while. Uh, but if you saw anything, leave a comment. If there's something, if there's a request that someone else has sent in, hit that thumbs up button. That you know, if you if you want to see it, I'm going to kind of treat this like uh, Baron and Fly do their their uh, plane request video series. Uh, you know, the the, mo the the vehicle with the most thumbs up will get the priority. And, uh, yeah, thank you all very much for watching. I, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, I'm going to try to do it one of these, like, once every six months or something. Because that there's not a whole lot to show, like, like each month. So I'm, I might space these videos out a bit. Anyway, guys, thanks, thanks again for watching. Take care.